My name is Corey, and I am a Music on the Move performer with the Muncie Symphony Orchestra, and I play the horn. The horn is a part of the brass family, alongside the trombone, the trumpet, and the tuba. So just like in the name, the horn is made out of uh, metal called brass. Um, my horn is actually plated with nickel, so it has a silver color to it. Uh, and most brass instruments you see will be either silver or gold. So, uh, just like with all the other brass instruments, I have this conical mouthpiece right here, and I put that on my lips and buzz into it like this. Oh. When I put the mouthpiece in the horn, the sound of my lips buzzing travels through all of these tubes and pipes, and it comes out of the bell here, and it gives us a nice, rich, dark tone like this. So the range of the horn is pretty wide, it's about four octaves, um, and we can play from about like the bottom all the way to uh, the higher alto range. So in the orchestra, sometimes the horns will play these heroic melodies with the brass section, and other times maybe we'll be paired up with the winds or the strings and play things that are a bit more melodic. So when uh, horns were first made, they didn't have valves like we do now. It was just the tubing, and they would be used for hunting horns, and they could only play a certain series of notes. Um, and in about the 19th century, we started seeing horns that had valves, and in uh, Germany, it was popular for horns with rotors to be installed like we have now. And in France, they usually use pistons. But um, sometimes we get the two confused, and so we call it the French horn, even though it's technically German. Before horns had valves, um, we had a technique called natural horn. And since we can only play a certain set of notes within a series, like this. It became necessary for us to use our hands to stop the note, which also lowers the pitch. And that way we could reach more notes uh, in the series, like this. And for another example, here is an excerpt from the uh, first Shostakovich cello concerto. <laughs> Thank you for joining me today to learn about the horn, and all of us at the Muncie Symphony Orchestra hope you have a great day.